Gary Lee McLeod. The Donald National Mall was a study Ray in contrast on Veterans Oswald. Day weekend. At Peter one end, crowds Sango. gathered at the National Vietnam Veterans Memorial Ronald for a solemn Charles reading of the names of the Edward. fallen. Mozan Nan, Edwin Reynolds Rudke Jr. At the other end, the purpose for both the quiet tribute and the parade down Constitution Avenue was the same, to commemorate the 25th anniversary of the Vietnam Veterans Memorial, which was dedicated in November of 1982. The event was spearheaded by groups including Vietnam Veterans of America and the Vietnam Veterans Assistance Fund, which have their own roots in the monument's creation. Well, 25 years ago, we, we realized when we dedicated the memorial that we needed to bond and support each other. And that, that led to the, actually the formation of Vietnam Veterans of America as a membership organization. We actually had our founding convention the following year. Uh -huh. And here we are 25 years later, and, and we find that we have not only supported each other and worked on our issues, but we've also paved the path for the new veterans so that they don't have to go through the same things that we encountered. Indeed, the current war in Iraq hung like a specter over both the gathering and the program that kicked off the day's events. When Jan Scruggs built that memorial for us, when we threw the parades for us, we took a vow that never again would this nation send young men and women into war without the committing of the nation first, without a commitment for the nation to bear the costs of caring for the warriors when they came home and for the families of those who did not return. That was our vow, but unfortunately we have not lived up to it. But most skewed political statements in favor of honoring the fallen from what is, for now at least, America's longest and most controversial conflict. James Ivory Coleman. It was overwhelming to see 58,000 some names, you know, engraved. It's just, it's beyond words, really. Mickey Roy Alexander. Danny Elbert Appleton. Jeremy Egner, American Observer News.